You're watching ETL. Share and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome to Entertainment Talk Nation. This is Rob. This video, we're going to talk more Star Wars, and it is time for me to do the one thing you guys know that I love to do. Speculate. Yes, speculate. Think of things and discuss things that may or may not happen in the movie. In this particular video, we're going to discuss whether or not we're going to see Obi-Wan Kenobi. Yes, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Now, I think there is a possibility. A small one, but I think there's a possibility we'll get an Obi-Wan uh, cameo. Uh, it would be nice if it was Hugh and McGregor, but we'll see what happens. But the reason I think this is because when you consider that Luke Skywalker is in this movie, and when you consider the relationship him and Ben had, and Ben being his early teacher and learning the Force, uh, I think it would kind of make sense if he still gets visits from Ben from the other side, you know, the, the Force Ben, if you will. And it would be nice. It would be a nice touch, you know. Uh, so I think it's definitely a possibility that we see Ben Kenobi. How, how much we see of him remains to be seen. I can't imagine that Luke at this point in his life would need that much guidance from Ben being a veteran Jedi himself now. But we don't know. We, we have no clue what's been going on with Luke since the end of Return of the Jedi. You know, and we've heard whispers of what may or may not be happening with him in this movie, but we don't know for sure until we see the film. So it, it would it would be nice if they had a moment where he still gets a visit from Ben, who still tries to impart some wisdom on him, uh, maybe helping him make decisions in the movie. Maybe he's torn between um, teaching someone how to be a Jedi. You know, maybe maybe he's not sure if he wants to do that in fear that if he teaches someone to be a Jedi, they'll only go to the dark side and further uh, give power to the Empire and the dark side. So that, that could be something that Ben has to help him decide or Ben gives him some, some advice on. So I don't think it's completely out of the element that Obi-Wan Kenobi makes an appearance in this movie and, and not a major appearance. But like I said, a short scene where him and Luke have a discussion about anything. I, I have no idea at this point. It's way too early to tell. But one thing I can think about, just off the top of my head, is the scenario of possibly uh, teaching another Jedi and Luke being, you know, kind of indecisive about doing it. You know, he's older now. He knows he's not going to be around much longer. And I'm sure if if he is, he I'm sure he's probably, and only in this scenario, he's thinking to himself, well, if I teach this person how to be a Jedi and I move on and I become one with the Force, I have no way of knowing whether or not they're going to completely be good and and do the Jedi thing or if they're going to turn to the dark side and just empower the Empire more. And then that's something I have to live with in the afterlife. It's something that I have to consider my fault. Where I think Ben would come in and, and try to tell him, look, whatever a person does with their life is their choice. They don't have to, you know, it doesn't affect you. It doesn't reflect on you. You know, you could very well not teach that person to be a Jedi, and they could still learn how to be a Sith. So there's no telling. So, you know, and that's, again, that's just an example of a scenario how I would see Obi-Wan playing a role in this new movie if he were to make a cameo and visit Luke to have a discussion with him about whatever the topic may be. But... We don't know for sure. Again, we, we are six months away from this movie, and we know that we're, we know about as much as we don't. You know what I mean? Like, there have been so many rumors surrounding this movie, and so many things we're not sure about that we will have no clue. But, but, I do think it is fair to say that it wouldn't surprise me if we got an Obi-Wan Kenobi cameo in this movie, especially considering that Luke's in it, and when you consider that relationship they had, during uh, A New Hope, and then even after that, when Ben used to come and visit him. So we will see. What do you guys think? Do you think Ben Kenobi will make a cameo in a short appearance in this movie to pay Luke a visit and have a discussion with his old, to uh, with his old student? Or, or do you think there's zero chance that at this point Luke shouldn't need him? That's a fair argument as well. You know, Luke may not need him at this point. He's probably learned a lot himself, and he's older now and a bit wiser, we hope. But we'll see. Comment below and let me know what your thoughts are on the topic. This is Rob signing off for ETN, where we don't do news, we just talk entertainment. Take it easy.
Thank you for watching ETN. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Join the nation's Facebook page to meet other subscribers or visit ETN's Facebook page and Twitter page. Links for all are in the description.